The Red Pyramid, also called the North Pyramid, is the largest of the three major pyramids located at the Dagshaw Necropolis. Named for the rusty reddish hue of its red limestone stones, it is also the third largest Egyptian pyramid, after those of Khufu and Khafra at Giza. It is also believed to be Egypt's first successful attempt at constructing a true smooth-sided pyramid. Local residents refer to the Red Pyramid as El Haram El Watwat, meaning the Bat Pyramid. The Red Pyramid was not always red. It used to be cased with white Jura limestone, but only a few of these stones now remain at the pyramid's base, at the corner. During the Middle Ages much of the white Jura limestone was taken for buildings in Cairo, revealing the red limestone beneath. History The Red Pyramid was the third pyramid built by Old Kingdom Pharaoh Sniferu, and is located approximately one kilometer to the north of the Ben Pyramid. It is built at the same shallow 43-degree angle as the upper section of the Bend Pyramid, which gives it a noticeably squat appearance compared to other Egyptian pyramids of comparable scale. Construction is believed to have begun during the 30th year of Sniferu's reign. Egyptologists disagree on the length of time it took to construct. Based on quarry marks found at various phases of construction, Rainer Stagelman estimates the time of completion to be approximately 17 years while John Romer, based on this same graffiti, suggests it took only 10 years and 7 months to build. Archaeologists speculate its design may be an outcome of engineering crises experienced during the construction of Sniferu's two earlier pyramids. The first of these, the Pyramid at Medum, collapsed in antiquity while the second a euro the bent pyramid a euro had the angle of its inclination dramatically altered a euro from 54 to 43 degrees a euro partway through construction. Some archaeologists now believe that the Medum pyramid was the first attempt at building a smooth-sided pyramid, and that it may have collapsed when construction of the bent pyramid was already well underway a euro, and that the pyramid may by then have already begun to show alarming signs of instability itself as evidenced by the presence of large timber beams supporting its inner chambers. The outcome of this was the change in inclination of the Bend Pyramid, and the commencement of the later Red Pyramid at an inclination known to be less susceptible to instability and therefore less susceptible to catastrophic collapse. Modern Day The Red Pyramid is 105 meters high. A rare pyramidion, or capstone, for the Red Pyramid has been uncovered and reconstructed and is now on display at Dashur. However, whether it was actually ever used is unclear, as its angle of inclination differs from that of the pyramid it was apparently intended for. The Red Pyramid, along with the Bend Pyramid, was closed to tourists for many years because of a nearby army camp. It is now usually open for tourists and a somewhat intrusive ventilation has been installed which pipes air down the entrance shaft to the interior chambers. Visitors climb steps cut in or built over the stones of the pyramid to an entrance high on the north side. A passage, three feet in height and four feet wide, slopes down at 27 a degree for 200 feet to a short horizontal passage leading into a chamber whose corbel roof is 40 feet high and rises in 11 steps. At the southern end of the chamber, but offset to the west, another short horizontal passage leads into the second chamber. This passage was probably closed at one time when the offset was a measure intended to confuse potential robbers. The second chamber is similar to the first and lies directly beneath the apex of the pyramid. High in the southern wall of the chamber is an entrance, now reached by a large wooden staircase built for the convenience of tourists. This gives onto a short horizontal passage that leads to the third and final chamber with a corbel roof 50 feet high. The first two chambers have their long axis aligned north-south, but this chamber's long axis is aligned east-west. Unlike the first two chambers, which have fine smooth floors on the same level as the passages, the floor of the third chamber is very rough and sunk below the level of the axis passage. It is believed that this is the work of robbers searching for treasure in what is thought to have been the burial chamber of the pyramid. See also, world's tallest freestanding structure on land. Great Pyramid of Giza, List of Egyptian Pyramids, List of Megalithic Sites. References, Roma, John. The Great Pyramid, Ancient Egypt Revisited. Cambridge University Press, Cambridge. ISBN 978-0-521-87166-2. Lena, Mark. 
The Complete Pyramids. Thames and Huston. ISBN 0-500-05084-8. Notes. Further reading, Werner, Miroslav, The Pyramids A Euro Their Archaeology and History, Atlantic Books, 2001, ISBN 1-84354-171-8. External links The Red Pyramid of Snowfu